Hello everybody, this is Jonathan and today I'll be getting Gnome in here, Josh, to work um, with my Gnome system. So this um, this script will allow my system um, to look like macOS. And here's some screenshots. Okay, let's get started. So let's go ahead and open up to the terminal. And we're going to have to install some packages. Okay, so let's first go ahead and update the system by doing sudo apt update. Let's on the enter key, enter your password. Five, five packages to be upgraded. Run apt list upgradable to see them. So, I will do right now is just do so you do apt upgrade. Let's on the enter key. So it does seem like there's some good name um, update. So I'm gonna go ahead and select Y and I'm gonna press on the enter key and then go allow this to update. I'll be back once it's done. I have just restarted my system. So now let's go ahead and install some packages. One that we need to install is a tconf editor. We'll need to go ahead and install Gnome 2 because we're always going to have to install Gnome extensions. So let's go ahead and do sudo apt install dconf add editor gnome tweaks and then we want to do gnome shell extensions press on the enter key enter your password um, let's go ahead and select Y. Press on the enter key and that should install these um, packages to our system. Awesome. Those have instructions for Fedora, they've got instructions for Arch Linux. But now we have to go and enable some GNOME extensions. So go to dash to dock, click on to install, open link, install. And I should have installed dash to dock. Let me go ahead to extensions just to see if it is enabled. Um, it seems like it is enabled. Cool. I will now go ahead and enable the other one. So if you have one that we need to enable is a free on. Let's go ahead and install it. Open link. Install. And it has been installed. So let me go back. Let me go ahead and select Dust Perfection. I'll go ahead and install it. Open link. Install. That has been enabled. So let me go ahead and enable Top Bar Organizer. I'm going to go ahead and install that one, open link, install, and that should have installed this um, extension. Amazing. So when I go back, um, the next thing I need to do is do a git clone of this repository so that we'll be able to gain the um, script. So to do it, all you do is go back to the terminal, type down git clone, https, dash dash github dot com j o t h i dash p r a s a t h dash gnome intosh gnome intosh um, dot get. I'm just double checking if it's correct. It looks like it's correct. Press on the enter key. Um, get clone. It needs to be um, get clone. Press on the enter key.
let me go ahead and type down our ls i want to now go into the directory so all you do is cd gnome in tosh press on the enter key and now we want to run the shell script to do so we have to um do the permissions um if we don't do this then what run because it need to be admin or um you need to add some some permissions to be able to run it so we need to do chmod plus x and i'll go do dot dash main dot sh press on the enter key that has worked i'll go ahead and now run the script by doing dot dash main dot sh press on the enter key and that should do some changes to the system Okay, so it looks like it has applied for new theme. <laughs> okay, let me just go ahead and just um, close out this terminal. I'll close out that one. Oh my gosh, it looks like a lot like Mac OS. <laughs> I just love it. Okay, so I can obviously go to files. Um, I can go ahead and open up to Firefox. Um, I don't know why it's positioned over there actually with the closing buttons. Um, but yeah, they do seem like it has changed a little bit to me more like Mac OS Even the um, wallpaper is now using like what they use for Mac OS um, So I'm gonna go ahead and just reboot the system um, Because I need to Just to check if it does need a restart That will be able to apply other changes to it And it might actually fix some problems and now we're back in GNOME <laughs> and it looks very much like Mac OS. Especially with this um, taskbar for bottom, they've got this um, calendar over there, they've got shut down the system over there. Um, they have some utilities over there. Please run sensors detect this route. But um, yeah, this is basically um, how I'll be able to use the um, script to be able to get the system to look a lot more like Mac OS. I assume I could maybe make some changes to it. We want to have for placement on the right. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, that's looking a lot better. Uh, being being on the right with the um, X button and yeah as you guys can see it does look a lot like Mac OS they also got show apps over here they've got um, an icon for files they've got software as well I don't know if that's look anything like Mac OS uh, it looks like any other um, GNOME but yeah um, it works pretty well anyway guys if I like this video please put a like and please subscribe and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.